Bruchim Aboim B'Shem Hashem. What a great schus that throughout the entire world we are all united learning the Parsha through Shnaim Yomi. In Shlishi of Parshas Bereshis, we read something fascinating. Hashem wants to create Chava, a wife for Adam Arishon. In that way we learn, Vayiven Hashem Elokim Es Hatzela, that Hashem took from the rib of Adam Arishon, and he put it in to Chava. How fascinating it is that he put in from the rib and not from a different place. Many of the Mephoshim ask the question, why wasn't it taken from the head? Why specifically the rib? Fascinating idea that we should always remember in marriage, Etzem me'atzamai, Basar Mibsari, she is not just, it's my wife. It's the lady I married. There's a girl. <laughs> they made a shidduch, so I ended up with her. No, 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 no. Etzem me'atzamai, Basar Mibsari. That is the reason why it is from the rib, because then we are both side by side, not that I am going to be the one that has all the greatness and the chashivus in life, not that she will have all the greatness in the chashivus in life, but rather that we are both together, that we both understand each other's malos, each other's quality, and that we appreciate each other for 120 years. My great Rosh Hashiva, Harav Simcha Wasserman, once was coming down the stairs in one of the homes in Flatbush and he had a tremendous smile. Walking down, he was smiling. Dr. Eisner, who was in the house, said, Reb Simcha, is there a particular reason why you're so happy? He says, of course. My Rebetzin, she's standing right there nearby. And when I see her, it brings a tremendous simcha to my life. Imagine, married over 50 years, and the simcha was like the day of the chuppah.